While most counties across the United States saw their populations shrink over the past decade, U.S. Census data released Thursday shows every county in Southern California grew from 2010 to 2020, thanks largely to increases among communities of color. America takes a head count every 10 years so governments can use the data to redraw boundaries of political districts, ensuring population is evenly spread among them. How those lines are drawn could help determine which party controls the U House of Representatives after the 2022 elections, while also reshaping all levels of politics for the decade to come. The data also shows trends, sweeping and granular, about population, geography and diversity. Counts released Thursday, for example, show that Riverside County was one of the fastest growing counties in California over the past decade, adding 228, 544 people. Riverside County's 10-year growth rate of 10. 4% is far above the state's rate of 6, 1% and more than double the overall figure for Southern California, according to researchers at UC Riverside who analyzed the data. San Bernardino County wasn't far behind, growing by 7, 2% from 2010 to 2020. Orange County grew at a slightly slower place than the statewide rate, adding 5, 9% to its population while Los Angeles County expanded by 2%. L.A. County, which saw its population surpass 10 million for the first time, remained the nation's most populous county. In terms of redistricting, the data out Thursday confirms predictions that Riverside County will likely soon see its political clout expand in both Sacramento and Washington, D.C. at the same time, sluggish growth means Los Angeles County stands to lose some representation. Final district boundaries are expected in early 2022. Population data also drives how a wide range of resources are allocated, including distribution of $1.5 trillion in annual federal spending. Every Southern California county stands to get a slightly larger share of that pie, since all have grown over the past decade, a time when 53% of all U counties shrunk. Riverside County, in particular, could see funding for things like transportation projects jump significantly during the 2020s. While it's too soon to say what specific categories figure to benefit, Jeff Van Wagenen, chief executive of Riverside County, said officials are optimistic they'll get new and increased funding allocations that provide for critically important services to our residents. Over the past decade, the United States overall grew at its slowest rate since the 1930s, gaining 22. 7 million people to reach a population of 331. 4 million. While California is estimated to have lost population during one year, from 2019 to 2020, the 10-year trend shows California trailed only Texas and Florida in terms of raw population growth, reaching 39. 5 million people, and remains the nation's most populous state. Several dozen Southern California cities did shrink over the past decade.